Ha, look, it's better framed. <laughs> Occasionally, I am not a completely sucky YouTuber. If we're being honest, I completely suck at doing this. So it's it's good to know that I am on brand for me. And today I'm wearing my, my Dread shirt, which if you've never seen the saga of Sundry's Dread or Madness, do yourself a favor and watch it. It is real good. It's a... Glasses are very dirty. It, it was something that Geek and Sundry did experimentally for a while. I think when Marisha Ray from Critical Role was their creative director. So, you know, things got, things were seriously weird under Marisha's stewardship and things got seriously dull when she left. Oh, clean glasses, a miracle. Anybody who has glasses knows that this will last about till now. So hi, it's me, Tree. The light is better because it's only like 10.30, though it's completely overcast, which means that the light's very nice. It's a, it's a, it's a lovely soft filter on all of this. <laughs> this is gonna be a real good video. All right, so today I actually have to go have blood tests done because my iron and my hemoglobin and <laughs> Legitimately, I don't necessarily understand everything that's going on with it because not a scientist or not a biologist. I enjoy physics and I enjoy chemistry. Biology is kind of like, mm, especially medical science because it still feels like they're just making things up, which is not entirely untrue. But yes, I have to go get blood tests done. They also have to look at my vitamin D probably. I think that's in this one too because my vitamin D is wrong. Considering how sick I was literally a year ago, one year ago, like yesterday, how sick I was because I had an upper GI bleed that led to a multitude of infections. As soon as they admitted me, they gave me like two units of blood because that's how bad it was. The arthritis flare that it caused I'm doing real good. I am doing amazingly. I, I mean, I don't get out of the house as much as I probably want to slash slash should, but that was true before I got sick too. I just, I live in kind of not quite the middle of nowhere. I mean, we live in a town and it's got like 9,000 people in it. I mean, we have a decent gear joint. There's not a whole lot to do here unless you want to go sit at the coffee shop or go to the diner or go to the movies and when you're kind of you know largely broke as you know teachers and artists have a tendency to be which my partner is a professor and I am an artist you don't get out much we, we, we spend that money on things like Hulu and Netflix and stuff that we can watch whatever we want but yes so you should get some exteriors today, which is slightly exciting, I think. Maybe. And you may just get me babbling more incoherently here because I have a giant phobia of doctors. I did before I got sick. I spent most of my childhood in and out of doctor's offices. I have a history of like my body being real crummy. It's like my body is janky and glitchy and my brain is a big bag of weasels <laughs> and demonic squirrels so it, I'm doing real good the, the, this is what happens when I, I I have to go to the doctor in any way shape or form it doesn't mean if I it doesn't matter if I'm just seeing the technician to get blood taken from me I I have this and I haven't had my antidepressants yet because I have to take them with food and I have been too freaked out to eat so th 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 this is <laughs> without my antidepressants like calming down the anxiety a titch it's gonna be a good day it's gonna be wonderful it's gonna it's gonna be fine yep maybe we'll just have a snoot prelude because snoots are the best i feel like there should be benny hill music or send in the clowns or something okay i'm gonna go i'm gonna i'm gonna snuggle some snoots maybe snuggle sloth maybe bug the cats 
I mean, they're all sleeping. I don't want to bother them while they're sleeping. That makes me weird, right? darlings I'm so excited and it it doesn't sound like much but it, it is a lot I walked from the entrance to the testing side of the hospital to the where the vampires live for testing it's the first time I've done it since I got sick I'm really excited and my veins cooperated which is also nigh on a miracle it's a minor miracle when my veins cooperate. I'm so excited, y'all! I did it real good! I walked there and back and... <sighs> I'm so proud of me! <sighs> and now Gnome and I are gonna go for celebratory pancakes. Because I did good. And because Gnome's semester has <laughs> ended. And it's been rough. So, celebratory pancakes. I'm gonna go. I, 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 I have to do other things besides freak out at the camera. In case I don't get back to talking to the camera because my doctor's appointment is at 1 and I have no idea how long it'll, it's gonna take like 15 minutes maybe. Assuming they're their usual like expedient selves. But I don't know what the light's gonna look like by then so I'm gonna go ahead and like do the close out now just in case this becomes worse than yesterday, which could happen because it's overcast and precipitating because I live in a northern hellscape. <laughs> I really don't hate it up here. It's just when you have mobility issues, ice is not your friend. Tis the season. Do good. Be kind. Be brave. Try not to panic. <laughs> Mostly at me, but also at you. Don't panic in big friendly letters. Encourage.
little, 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 little,